Yeah, 54 year old Michael Millette will be spending at least seven and a half years behind bars. How do you plead for that charge, sir? Guilty or not guilty? Guilty. Millette pleaded guilty on his felony count of selling fentanyl, a controlled drug and narcotic pain reliever, resulting in the death of his friend, 28 year old Edward Martin III. Millette also pleaded guilty to three lesser possession counts. Prosecutors say they struck a plea with Millette. It's one of which he is pleading guilty here today, uh, second of which um, he, well, second of which he is going to do a public service announcement for the community, which Attorney Hornick has indicated that he would do, and that was brought to our attention as well. And um, he also uh, is going to apologize to the family. Law enforcement says Millette's sentence will be a helpful tool. I think it's a it's a message statewide uh, to get the message out there that if you're going to deal drugs and people die from it, then we're going to hold you accountable. Martin's family spoke to the judge before he handed down his sentence. He taught me how to enjoy the small things in life, how to fight for my beliefs, but most importantly, he taught me to value every type of reality. They don't know that. So now, Millette's arrest and now sentencing involved the Littleton Police Department and police departments from the surrounding communities, as well as the New Hampshire Drug Task Force. Live in North Haverhill, Suzanne Rontree, WMUR News 9.